Hey there, I'm Okwai, and today I'm taking you on an amazing colorful journey. If you've ever wondered if there's a way to see the world in even more colors, then this video is exactly what you've been looking for. Let's dive into an exciting journey where we'll explore a groundbreaking approach to color perception that unlocks the potential for us to see and differentiate over a billion new colors. My research aims to push the boundaries of human color vision, going beyond the limits of the traditional trichromatic spectrum. Get ready to experience a world that's richer and more vibrant than ever before as we uncover the hidden potential of our eyes and introduce a new way of seeing the world around us. Welcome to the first part of a series that showcases the capabilities of my virtual reality app, Color in Color. In this episode, we'll learn the core concept behind Color in Color and how it brings these augmented colors to life through a range of eye-catching images and videos. In the following episodes, we'll dive deeper into the app's functionality and share the programming magic that makes it all possible. So, without further ado, let's start by giving some basic explanations. The phenomenon of binocular redundancy Alright, let's talk about an interesting phenomenon called binocular redundancy. To make it easier to understand, let me first explain binocular vision. You know how we have two eyes. Well, they're set up in a way that their fields of view overlap, allowing both eyes to see the same object at once. This setup creates binocular redundancy. That means that our brain receives multiple sources of visual information from our eyes, which helps improve our visual perception and accuracy. It's like having a backup system for our vision. Understanding how binocular redundancy works and how to break it down is really important for grasping the more advanced concepts we'll be discussing later in this video. So, keep this in mind as we move forward. The illusion of new colors, binocular color mixing explained. Let's talk about an amazing way to experience new colors using our trichromatic vision, which is based on our eyes having three types of color receptors. By combining colors in a unique way, we can actually see impossible colors that are different from any color we've seen before. For example, when we usually see yellow, our brain is actually mixing red and green components. But what if we show red to our right eye and green to our left eye? This creates a completely different yellow, unlike any other color we've ever experienced, including standard yellow. This cool trick can be done with other color combinations too, like blue-yellow, magenta-blue, red-yellow, orange-yellow and green-cyan. By adding these impossible color mixtures to our existing color spectrum, we can potentially perceive hundreds of new colors, each one offering a unique color experience. The best part is that we can still maintain our normal color vision while experiencing these higher order color mixtures like tetrachromacy, pentachromacy or hexachromacy. This color in color approach takes advantage of binocular redundancy, which we talked about earlier, to expand the range of colors we can see by showing different color inputs to each eye. This way, our brain can process a richer array of color information and allow us to perceive an even wider range of colors, or more specifically, the normal color range in more color detail. Creating impossible colors, challenges and technological solutions. Now, if we want to bring these impossible colors into our daily lives, we need technology that can show us these amazing color combinations. Colored lenses can change colors a bit, but they can't create something like a pure red and blue experience at the same time. So, we need something better, and that's where virtual reality headsets come in. You see, VR headsets show separate images for each eye, which means we can play with the colors in one display, adjust them as we want, and show the new version instead of the original. This cool technique lets us show different colors to each eye, making it possible to see these incredible, never-before-seen colors, and bring impossible colors into our everyday visual experiences. Multiplying the rainbow, creating impossible colors with VR technology. To bring impossible colors into our daily lives, we need a mix of skills from different fields, like software engineering and color manipulation. So, I've been working on an app that makes it easier for us to experience these amazing colors every day. The app takes our usual color spectrum, squeezes it a bit and adds new color variations inside the original range. It's like we are multiplying the rainbow. But just changing the color spectrum isn't enough to let us see impossible colors. That's where virtual reality headsets come in handy, thanks to their dual screen feature. One screen shows the regular colors, while the other screen adds some color magic. When these two screens work together, we get a huge range of unique and never before seen color combinations. And that's how we can experience impossible colors. An easy simulation of tetrachromacy with color in color. Now, let's dive into the amazing possibilities of the Color in Color app by looking at a special case called Tetrachromacy. 
People with tetrachromacy have four types of color receptors in their eyes instead of the usual three, which means they can see a much wider range of colors. While most of us can see about 1 million colors, tetrachromats might be able to see up to 100 million colors, all thanks to an extra color receptor that's sensitive to different light wavelengths. This rare condition, almost exclusively found in women due to a genetic mutation, is still debated because it's so hard to test for. But with the Color in Color app, we can try to mimic what it's like to be a tetrachromat by tweaking the settings, like setting the hue augmentation level to 2 in the first and second level hue multiplications to 4 and 3, we can start to see subtle color differences that were invisible to our eyes before. It's like getting a glimpse into the world of a tetrachromat. Here are some more examples of this simulated tetrachromacy. I can't show you the left and right eye images overlapping each other directly, because you're currently watching this video on a single screen. So, for this here showcase, you have to cross your eyes and manually overlap the two images and videos in order to see the impossible color combinations. If you can't cross your eyes or don't want to, you'll have to compare the two images by moving your eyes back and forth. Remember that the images and videos that you are currently seeing are just simulations of tetrachromacy. We do not know and will probably never know what real tetrachromacy looks like. But this simulation is the closest we can currently get to it, without getting a bit more invasive and transforming our genes and very biology. But because any invasive methods always entail the chance of irreversibly damaging your body, a simulation of tetrachromacy by using external technology is generally the safer option to choose. Tetrachromacy Simulation After exploring the fascinating world of simulated tetrachromacy, let's take it a step further and dive into the even more amazing possibilities of simulated pentachromacy. Animals with pentachromacy have five types of color receptors in their eyes, compared to the four in tetrachromats and the usual three in most people. This means pentachromats can see an unbelievably wider range of colors. While tetrachromats might be able to see up to 100 million colors, pentachromats could potentially perceive an astounding 10 billion colors, all due to having two extra color receptors sensitive to different light wavelengths. Just like tetrachromacy, pentachromacy is an even rarer and even more debated condition because it's highly improbable to occur in humans, but not entirely impossible. How convenient that the Color in Color app allows us to venture even further and also simulate what it's like to experience pentachromacy. By adjusting the settings to build upon our tetrachromacy simulation, like setting the hue augmentation level to 2 and the first and second level hue multiplications to 8 and 7.5 we can uncover even more subtle color differences that were previously invisible to our eyes, even with simulated tetrachromacy. I think you understand now that in this way we can simulate color in an arbitrary dimensionality. So, let's check out some examples of this simulated pentachromacy, taking our color perception to a once again higher dimension. Again, I can't show you the left and right eye images overlapping each other directly. So, you once again have to cross your eyes and manually overlap the two images and videos in order to see the impossible color combinations. Remember that the images and videos that you are currently seeing are just simulations of pentachromacy. Just like in the case of tetrachromacy, or even more so, we do not know and will probably never know what real pentachromacy looks like. These images and videos are truly fascinating. The amount of new colors we can differentiate in comparison to the unaltered original is nothing but incredible. Everything has quite literally color in color, because we are now able to see even the smallest color changes within a seemingly monochromatic color. Especially with the pentachromacy simulation, the augmented impossible colors aren't just integrated neatly into the visible spectrum but the amount of new colors inserted is a good balance of not being too much or too little. Color Augmented Value, the feature Color in Value The Color in Color app doesn't just stop at enhancing colors, it also helps improve our perception of color values by recycling standard colors. This means that we can spot tiny changes in color value more easily when we introduce different levels of augmentation. Instead of only seeing shades of one singular color in a given color value like we usually do, the color in value feature lets us see different multiple colors in it. This leads to a whole new range of value perception, like do value see, tri value see, tetra value see, and even more, going beyond the basic mono value see we're used to. This awesome feature can help us see better in tricky lighting situations, like at night or in super bright environments, where it's usually hard to see important details because of under- or overexposure. By using color augmented values, we can uncover loads of hidden visual info, making it easier to understand our surroundings and perform tasks that rely on good vision. When we bring together the power of the color in color and color in value features, we get a game-changing way to see colors, opening up a whole new world of bright and lively visuals for us to explore. Expanding the spectrum, color in color and its wide range of applications. 
The Color in Color app is super versatile and can make a big difference in many areas of life. It lets users tweak color details to customize what they see for specific tasks and situations, helping them notice small changes in color that they might have missed otherwise. There are so many ways we could use this app. Figuring out different types of fruits, spotting medical issues from skin color changes, creating awesome visual effects for images and videos, or even inventing new ways to express ourselves through art and design that go beyond the usual rules of color. With all these different uses, Color in Color becomes a super handy tool for science, medicine and creative work. In the end, this amazing technology changes how we think about color, making it a more immersive and exciting experience that takes our understanding of color to a whole new level. What it cannot do. Right now, finding virtual reality headsets with top-notch color pass through cameras can be tricky, especially if you're looking for something affordable. Most of these devices have just one color camera with not so great resolution. Ideally, we'd want two high-resolution color pass-through cameras for the best results. Plus, lots of headsets don't let us access or process the image or video from the color pass-through camera, which makes things even more difficult. This limitation stops us from creating a live version of the Color in Color app, where we could see the real world with amazing, enhanced colors in real time. But as technology gets better and VR headsets come with higher quality cameras and more powerful processing, I'll be able to improve the Color in Color app even more. This will open the door to incredible color experiences that change the way we see the world around us. Closing words. In conclusion, the Color in Color app is truly groundbreaking with the power to change our perception of color in incredible ways. By enhancing colors and values, it opens up a world of new experiences like getting a taste of tetrachromacy, pentachromacy, hexachromacy and even higher color dimensions or seeing hidden details and challenging or obscure lighting conditions. With applications in science, medicine and creative fields, this app is more than just a fun tool. It has the potential to reshape our understanding of color itself. And as VR headsets keep improving with better cameras and processing power, we can look forward to even more advanced versions of the Color in Color app. Who knows? In the future, our color experiences might become more immersive and dynamic than we ever thought possible, giving us an entirely new way to see and appreciate the world around us. And thankfully, in the meantime, Color in Color brings us already almost halfway there. It's an exciting time to explore the limitless potential of color vision. So, stay tuned and subscribe in order to fetch new ways to experience life. I am Ukwai, and I will show you how to reshape and enhance your sensory experiences, because it is nothing but our senses that connect us to this world. Thanks for watching.